All right, guys, it's been quite a while. I haven't filmed anything because I've been sick, but I just went into this Walmart right here and there was a whole bunch of awesome collectible horror toys. So let's look at them. Holy crap, guys. Yeah, look at this. They have all kinds of awesome toys here. Oh, look, they have Boglins down here. Holy crap, that is so cool. Look at the eyes on that thing. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff in these aisles here. All right, where are we gonna start? All right, let's just start right here. We got the Candyman Funko Pop 1157. What is this, like from the remake? That's pretty cool. I don't know if you guys have seen the Candyman movie, but I remember it scared the crap out of me back in the day. Okay, oh, look at this. They got Candyman with bees here. Now this is sweet. Oh my gosh, look at his face. He got the bees all over his face. I love that. <laughs> that is hilarious. Look at this. We have Vincent Price over here. Look, he's got a cat. Holy crap, he's got a black cat. I actually had a black cat one time. I named him Azriel, like uh, like the cat on the Smurfs. What in the world is this hiding up here? Look, it's a Ghostbusters wallet, like a zip pack with uh, Stay Puffed and Slimer. Phantom of the Opera. They got a whole bunch of stuff here. Just, I'm afraid to move anything. I feel like it's all gonna fall. <gasps> Holy crap, look what I just found. Jeepers Creepers. Okay, now this is awesome. Have we seen this before, guys? I know I've done a couple of these videos of the toys at Walmart, but I don't think we've ever seen <laughs> this Jeepers Creepers. How cool is that? It comes with the ax and everything. I need to watch Jeepers Creepers again. It's been a long time since I've seen that movie. All right, let's look at these Boglins for a minute because these things are awesome. If I'm not mistaken, these first came out in like the 80s or the 90s. Look at that thing. That looks like John Wayne Gacy. That's probably what it's supposed to look like too. Oh my gosh, look how it moves. It's like this weird rubber material. I'm gonna have nightmares about that thing. And look, they're puppets. You put your hand up inside and move his eyes in his mouth. I just saw his eyes move the opposite direction. Strange. Yeah, there's the eye controls right there. And that's the mouth. Things are so weird. Look, there's a couple of different kinds. Ooh, this one doesn't have the bars. So we can see what it feels like. Ugh, it's just so weird. <laughs> Look how he bounces in there when you move him. This one's got horns and a green head. Look, he's got one tooth. He has one tooth. He needs the Aquafresh for his one tooth. All right, what's this one? This guy looks like a pumpkin. Look, he's orange and his face is looks like a carved pumpkin. Do these things have names? Dark Lord Boglins. This one's glow in the dark too. Blobkin is his name. Okay, yeah, this one's called King Drool. And this one's Blobkin, and he looks like a pumpkin. And look at this one. This one's called Bogo Bones. What in the world? Look, this one's called King Dork. <laughs> he looks like he's gold. Those knobs on his head remind me of Shrek. Okay, look at all this stuff they have on the other side. Like, it's not a lot of horror stuff. But look at this. It's a Stranger Things boombox. That's pretty cool. Personally... I would go on eBay and buy like a legit vintage one or just keep an eye out at the Goodwill because I used to find these all the time at Goodwill. Here's a Stay Puffed bobblehead. That's pretty cool, but it's from Christmas. Um, can I get a discount, please? Okay, what are these? Oh, these are other little Funko Pops. These are giant pins. They're like enamel pins. We got Dracula. Oh, this is cool. Frankenstein. Did we look at these before? I look at these things every time I come in here, so I can never remember what I filmed before. Uh, whoops, here's one we haven't seen. The Wolfman, that's pretty cool. Alright. 
And what's this one? Bride of Frankenstein. All right, that's cool. I just like giant pins. All right, yeah, we got a lot of stuff over here. This is the typical stuff that we look at when we come in here. But there's a whole bunch more down here, all these different collectible things that we're gonna look at. And then over here is a whole bunch of pops. Look at this, oh my gosh, they have the plush WWE or F uh, <laughs> superstars. I wonder if these are, remember you could get the big ones and you actually wrestle with them? I thought maybe these made some sound or something. I'm not really into wrestling, but those are kind of cool. Oh look, we got a, uh, a Pennywise zipper wallet case thing. I don't know, that's kind of cool. I'm not going to carry it, but okay. All right, what are these? Gage and Church from Pet Cemetery. Look at that. It's the dead but alive cat. <laughs> Young blood. Hmm, okay. Yeah, there's tons of these pops here. Oh, look, they got Mikey from the Goonies. That's cool. Uh, let's see. Deadpool. Um, we want to see more like horror stuff. What in the world? Alligator. Look at that. He's got a fish in his mouth. It's like a trout. Holy crap, they got Josh Baskin from the movie Big. He's on the big piano, too. That is so funny. Oh my gosh, Pops are so cool. Look at this. Lloyd Christmas in his orange tuxedo. Look, we got Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. And look at this one. Val Little from Monsters. <laughs> Whoa, look at this. We got a huge Michael Myers. That thing's bigger than my head. That is pretty awesome. Look at this. Look how big this thing is. That is cool. Oh, look, there's a lot of big ones on the end here, too. Let's check these out. Uh, let's see, Avengers, Alice in Wonderland. Look at this. Here's a Zombies one, Marvel Zombies. And, oh my gosh, He-Man, how cool is that? Michelangelo, Carnage. Oh, you can't see it. You can barely see them because of the reflection from the TVs, but yeah, we got Carnage there, the Cheshire Cat from Alice in Wonderland, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I wish they had more big ones that were horror themed, but all right, let's go back into the aisle here. Ooh, and right off the bat, we got a Toonie Terrors, Michael Myers. That's cool, look at the pumpkin in there. I love that. Look at this, we got a Gremlins Gizmo here, a dancing Gizmo plush doll. All right, I gotta see it. How do I get him to dance? Dance Giz, remove twist tie from Gizmo's neck. Oh, all right, I'm not gonna do that, unfortunately. Love you, Giz, sorry, no dancing today. We got a Toonie Terrors Beetlejuice. I gotta watch Beetlejuice again. Look at that face, his eyes are like crossed. I haven't watched Beetlejuice in quite a while. Garbage Pail Kids, heck yes. Oh, okay, now this is like a, a mashup. I see. Gigantic Andre, it's a mashup with WWE. That's supposed to be Andre the Giant. Seething Steve, <laughs> like Stone Cold Steve Austin. Savage Randy, look at this. Macho Man, that is pretty awesome. Oh, and look, we got Unraveled Warrior. It's like the ultimate warrior. These are all based on like the 80s wrestlers when wrestling was really cool because everybody had just such an awesome presence. Okay, that's not an 80s one, but like this one and this one, Andre the Giant. I don't see any Hulkamanias in there. Okay, back to the scaries. Here's a ghost face. Now this is pretty cool. It's a Toonie Terrors and that is pretty awesome. I've seen some ghost face toys that I really didn't think were cool. I thought they were just kind of thrown together, but this is totally awesome. I love this. Speaking of ghost face, we also have the handmade by robots vinyl ghost face. That one's okay. I mean, if you're into collecting uh, this style, not my favorite, but it's all right. Okay, now these are going to be cool. I don't know if we've looked at these anywhere yet. Hold on. Okay, come on now. Yeah, oh, crap, we can't see what he looks like, like the actual figure, but this is what it is. It's a predator figure. That is pretty cool. It looks like he's got just an enormous head, like his head is way too big for his body. 
Q figure, okay. And then it looks like we got the same one for aliens. I wanna see what he looks like, hold on. I just called him a he, it's an alien queen. Yeah, that, that's pretty cool. You gotta love toys like this, man. Maybe we should put her in charge. Look at this, Ghostbusters, Mini Puffs, Bobblescape. It's the Mini Puffs making a s'mores out of one of the little puffs. Sorry, guy, you're about to be eaten. What in the world? It's a plush Fruity Pebbles box. I love Fruity Pebbles. Literally one of my favorite cereals in the whole wide world. I'd eat a whole box right now. Oh, here's a sweet one. Gremlins Stripe. I need to watch Gremlins again, too. This is what happens when I come in here and I start looking at all this stuff. I'm like, oh, that was a cool movie. I need to watch it to everything that I see. Look, he comes with a chainsaw. Does he? Yeah, there's a chainsaw back in there. You can just barely see it hiding around the corner. And a skateboard. So cool. Here we got another creeper. He's so cool. All right, let's hang him up somewhere. And look at this, Child's Play 2, hand-painted quality resin. Look at that. He looks a little bit older than Chucky should look, but it's kind of cool. You gotta love the good guy's bibs. Pan's Labyrinth, that's one I've never seen. That is pretty creepy looking. Let's get a look at it and so, whoa. Holy crap. I don't think I ever want to see that guy's face again. <laughs> Sorry, chick. Closing the door. Have fun. Here's some gargoyles action figures. This one's called Goliath. That's the name of my RV. Goliath, because he's so huge. Dang, look at that guy. He's pretty creepy looking. We got a King Kong here. I think we've seen this guy before. Uh, let's see. Yep, here's Pennywise, the old one, like the... I think it was the 90s and looks like the same one behind him more Beetlejuice uh, ghost face yeah I like these toony terrors wish they had more of those Hannibal Lecter from Silence of the Lambs that's another movie I want to go watch now <laughs> and look it comes with his little mask there that's cool uh, those are all Star Trek's back there here's another candy man he doesn't have any bees on his face. But that's That looks more like Candyman. Yeah, that's the older one. I think, pretty sure they did a, a remake. Or they're doing one or something. Oh, look at this. We got Dracula here. That looks pretty cool. Look at his face. He definitely needs the Aquafresh. <laughs> Couple of gremlins here. Yeah, look at that guy. I love how it comes with the, the doodah bar and the brad bites, which are supposed to be like Skittles, and the, uh, the cards there. That's funny. And surprisingly, I think that's pretty much it. I mean, there's a bunch of other kinds of toys mixed in. Look, we got a Bob Ross down here, and Zelda, and what in the world is this thing? Star Wars mask? Boss K? Bosk? I don't know. I don't know what that is. I do like how they have these arcade one-up uh, video games out now. They're like the old stand-up arcade games. You know, back in the day, we used to actually go to an arcade in the mall, and these stand-up games would just, there'd be rooms that were just full of them, hundreds of them, and they were so awesome. These are smaller than those, but one day, I wanna have my own arcade in my house. And they have all the old machines that I love. Kung Fu Master, Pac-Man, Asteroids, Galaga, Qbert. I definitely have to get Qbert. But these are pretty cool. They're just smaller. Yeah, that's pretty much it, though, for the horror theme stuff. We just got superheroes here. Phantom, Flash Gordon, Ultimate Action Figures. Okay. Oh, here's Candyman on Blu-ray. That's the one we were just talking about. Look, he's got a hook. Oh, this is the remake. So I was right. They did do a remake. Hmm. I'll have to see it. I, I get partial to the originals, though, and it's tough for me to like remakes. I told you to stay away. Oh, my God. <laughs> what are you doing? 